where are you taking me? I was gonna take you to my hideout, but first I gotta rescue my friends at the Gelatonium. Factory. right over my hideout. I haven't been out this far in a while. Got a lot of swamp acid between here and the Morts of Gelatonium factory. Those beetles appear to have no issue with the acidic swamp water. Beetles, yeah. That's why I'm gonna ride one, as soon as I can get close enough. Whoa. This wasn't what was in my account last time. Oh, that is because I added our Mutual friend on Nefarious City. Okay. Ah, the only weapon who has destroyed Little Zircon's enemies and performed at his last birthday party, Mr. Fun Guy. Just throw him out. Uh, you got the bone, sugar. Treat yourself. Rooting your enemies into the ground with the topiary sprinkler. Spawn a turret, then warps your foes into defenseless, trimmable hedges. Legends tell of a weapon that contains energy so powerful. A beam of it will obliterate enemies with the mere press of a button. And it is called... The Negatron Collider! Obliterate your enemies in a row, or sweep your collider through the crowd. The energy to blast away evil is in your head. That one gonna be a doozy! Looks like you got some open sales and the raritanium to match. That is one mighty fine enhancement. Come on back for upgrades when you level that up. You will be missed, sweet.
not advise that. You dispatch them quite capably. Where's that speedo going? It appears some dimensional distortion is emanating from that cave. Bot. What is this place? I, um, a dimensional pocket? Perhaps a symptom of the Dimensionator's destruction. How do you come up with this stuff? Hey, it's Maynard, the Mortz's helper bot. Must have wandered in through the rift somehow. There is the Speedle. No, no, don't hide! Ugh. Away from this acid. Come on, Maynard! Let's find the Morts! Excuse me! Look out! I got it! I got it! See? Sometimes I don't crash. the gelatonium factory. I'm coming, Mortz. We didn't follow that Lombax and his robo-pet across dimensions just to get stopped by some fuzzballs. So you got like nine and a half seconds to tell us where they're at. One. <laughs> Hang on there now. See, they are looking for Ratchet. I am telling the truth. Whatever, Bolts. I'm gonna save my friends. Hey, I know where you can find a Lombax. Another Lombax? Tell us where your friend is, Brutalino. Where are these doofuses coming from? Perhaps they were sucked through the dimensional vortex as well. it keeps getting bigger. Oh, between that and our new neighbor up there, we are not doing too fine. <sighs> Don't worry, I'll take care of it. Oh, and to keep you all busy while I'm gone, got this at Zerkis. Mort can finally fix that ship she's been working on. Zerkis? Oh, those pirates didn't give you any trouble, did they? Eh, only a little. You can give this to Mort yourself once you get her from that purple mess over there. Enemy's not getting the point. Hit them over and up. Oh, the ricochet! Pull the fire trigger to shoot it at your useless enemy! Oh, oh, oh my! And then it will pop back up next to them!
Berserker loves turning bolts into bullets. Somehow. with that rift thingy. Your rift tether, yes. Try aiming at the rift. Another way 
across. I may regret suggesting this, but what about the speedle? What about it? Let's go! Almost home! And there's another Gruntor in the way! I do regret this. Come on! We both know how this is gonna end, big guy! locks. I could talk with Ratchet. Home sweet home. Why are you so hesitant to trust me? Look, robots aren't really my thing. Especially when they're tearing my galaxy apart. I am not. I was trying to help Ratchet find the other Lombaxes. We'll see the truth soon enough. Once I scan you and the Infobot I found in Nefarious City. This is extremely unnecessary. As I have been saying, repeatedly. You're nefarious. He looks a lot like mine. Evil like him, too. And that Lombax. I know it might sound crazy, but... You think he is your dimensional counterpart. Or something. Look, whatever's going on here, we're gonna fix it. We? I thought robots are... Not your thing. Not all of them, just most. You know, like the Emperor, his stupid followers, pirates. Yeah, I see the irony too. Oh, I apologize. I did not mean to, um... You feel bad? Even though I just watched your brain diary thingy? Oh, my God. 
should be on its back. If I can get up there and hit it, I can bring the whole thing down. Unfinished business. And now we can help out the Mords caught up in whatever that thing is.
hooked you up with a signal booster to fix that communicator of yours. Well, that would be delightful. <laughs> Not as thrilling as what we're going to find in this info bot, but it'll be close. Ah! Okay. Do not enter. Got it. May I take a look? I have some experience with dimensional anomalies. I... Sure. Hmm. Ah. Ah. Look at... Greetings! Welcome! How did you get in here? Where exactly is, um... Here? Oh, you don't know? Well, I don't either. It appears to be a space between dimensions. Could be nothing. Could be a cascading entropic fissure that will soon turn the entire universe into a formless soup. Time will tell. Oh. Oh, dear. Well, I am Clank. Please allow me to help. Right, yes, Clank. I am the all-seeing cosmic prophet of interdimensional sector 2255 phase Omega. But you can call me Gary. Here we are, Clank, former warbot, uh, teamed up with the Lombax, became a hero. Who good for you? Ooh, ooh, friend of my father. I see. Your father? You might just be the one I've been waiting for. Would you like to help me fix the dimensions? You know how to fix the dimensions? And why are there copies of me running around? They're your possibilities. The key to repairing the tsunami. But first, pick up that nearby sphere. This is a lift sphere. It can reduce the gravity on any object it touches. It seems your possibilities are what keeps an anomaly from collapsing. They look like you because that's how you interpret dimensionality. But as you can see, they've lost their way. If you can guide them to the meta terminal ahead, you will begin to repair this anomaly. I feel like things are slowly starting to make sense, dimensionally speaking. Ah, a speed sphere. That'll get hey. you moving. Hey. Oh. Hey. Hmm. I bet some extra speed could make quick work of that barrier. Do you live on Sargasso too, Gary? Savali, actually. I've been studying in the archives. It's the greatest repository of dimensional knowledge I've ever seen. That device may be able to redirect my possibilities. There must be a way to activate it. Outstanding! You seem to be a natural at this, Clank. I am cautiously optimistic. I feel myself learning something by completing these puzzles, but I cannot explain what it is. The words will come to you when you are ready. Now, lead your possibilities to the final meta-terminal. And not to stress you out, but there's a lot riding on this. Hmm. Like, a lot, a lot. If I fix this anomaly, will that fix all the damage that has been done in this dimension? Oh, no. Uh, anomalies are spreading too quickly to do that. I'm afraid a dimensional cataclysm is coming, and our only hope to stop it is with that which caused it. The Dimensionator? Indeed. But if repairing anomalies is helping you learn about dimensionality, I think you'll soon be able to learn enough to save us all. Hopefully. I wonder if I will be able to solve all of this in the end. What makes you say that? It has been a long time since I have been a hero. And with everything that happened with the Dimensionator, I am concerned. In times of great stress, which seems to be every day of my life, <laughs> I've always found it best to take things one step at a time and focus on what's in front of me.
now we're one step closer to stopping the dimensional cataclysm. Yo. So then I says, listen, Mort, you, Mort, and Mort better hide that lemonade before Mort shows up. Whoa! You saved them! How did you do that? I am uncertain. <laughs> Rivet! How the heck are you? Look who it is! <laughs> <laughs> you would not believe my luck today. My trip to Nefarious City went totally sideways, I wrecked my ship, and I... Uh -huh. You go on and leave that one to old Mort. <laughs> well, assuming you brought that part I asked for, hmm? I'll have this old thing in ship shape. <laughs> Rivet, ship's ready and waiting for you. All right, Bolts, I owe you a signal booster. And for that, we gotta go to Zerkis.